Good morning, everyone. My name is Sanjo Gaul. I'm your host today. Um, so what we are doing here is talking about two different areas, which is relevance and resilience. When I talk about relevance, which talks about exactly what an organization has to do in order to grow and innovate and not fall behind because the business and IT environment is changing rapidly. And then you talk about resilience. The resilience is all about taking care of the problems that you may face if you have issues from external forces that you have to deal with. In either case, if you notice there's a common thread, how do you go about dealing with both? You have to do business analytics. And in order for you to have the business analytics come into reality, you need big data. The theme for today is to talk about the big data, the tools, technology, strategies, anything and everything that you want to do leveraging big data and bring the value for government sector. So please enjoy this uh, event. What we are going to be doing is talk about items which you have to give input into and do it in a conversational manner, tender, and also make sure that you are going to be working with all of you as a group. You are not an individual. We are going to create collective intelligence here. So hopefully you will enjoy the presentations and the group discussions that we're going to host. Thank you so much. And our first presenter today is Poonam Gupta Krishnan. Thank you, Sanjog. And good morning, everybody. Thank you for taking time to come to GTF. I want to start out with a story of this weekend. My son, a middle schooler, had a friend's birthday party. When I picked him up, the friend's mom came out to the door and shared that her husband is about to lose a job, who is just five years away from retiring. The emotions are pretty high. She said she has four boys and has never worked and don't know where to begin. On my way back, my son asked that Jonathan's dad worked so many years and the people who work so many years, how can they be poor? I thought about it. I thought about GTS mission to create IT innovation, to create economic prosperities in our community. What we need to change, I thought about that. And then I realized we don't need to change, we need to reform. And there are two questions that we as a GTF members, supporters, team have to answer. And that is reform of what and for whom? Do we need reform to, to come out and have an intellectual discussion and, and, and score some points in, in the intellectual community to be able to speak at, at uh, a good platform and get a, a next job or we want to transform to become a society where there is no term like working poor. And then the next question of who. Who do we want to transform? We want to transform each and every citizen of the country to live up to the best of their potential and enjoy the satisfaction and, and safe environment. In 2011, I reached out to Illinois Institute of Technologies, Innovation, Director of Innovation and Application Services, Praveen Gupta, with a question. Say, how come such an innovative country does not have that much IT innovation in the government sector? 
He said the only way to find out was ask them. With the Praveen's help, with IIT support, we started an experiment called Technology Innovation Summit in 2011. 2012, one of the moderators, Dr. Jim Telavan, sitting back there, came on board and said, let's make it better. In 2013, a good friend, Alan Kerner, with a lot of experience in a public sector, said, this, has thing, this thing has the potential. Let's do something more about it. And then, county board president, many CIOs, CIO of Cook County, City of Chicago, RTA, Metra, joined their hands and supported. With the four people, we formed a not-for-profit called Government Technology Foundation and launched it March 26, 2014. With the four founders, myself, Ellen Turner, Praveen Gupta, and Jim Telemann. And then we got the support for Commissioner. Commissioner Steele is, is a big advisor. Many CIOs, procurement director, small business owners, and most people who sat in one of our events like you today. So I invite you to join hand, share your skills, talents, educations, resources to make a change in the community, to be the architect of the future where our kids would not have to ever hear the word working poor. Your being here is a testimony of your willingness, your eagerness to find out that how you can con contribute to make a difference. So I invite you all to be a part of GTF and make a change that is a transformation to make America greater always. Thank you.